I'm back on Parlin after one month off. I unexpectedly went to Spain. Shit happens. I went to Germany to a friend's wedding and now I'm back on my little boat and this week's plan is to fit the flooring in. Uh, let me show you it. All the holes are drilled in it, it's oiled, it's painted, it's ready to put in, it should just be like putting together an IKEA sofa. Well, hopefully a bit easier than that. There we go, came together like a dream. Let's put some flooring on that now. All the flooring is in and I've tidied her up. You can see the red fuel tank at the back. Tomorrow I'm going to plumb that in. I had a little problem with the fuel tank. The uh, pipes are the wrong size. So rain stops play on that one. So I'm going to look at the electrics today. The electrics kind of well, I don't know really how to describe this. So now things are a bit cleaner. On the right you can see the battery clips. On the left the two white tubes are for the steering. And the set of cables in the black surround is from the engine. That now goes up. You can see joining it now from the right the other white cable, which is for the gear shift. The blue cable is the accelerator and the red cable is the engine stop. So we're doing all right so far. Then we've got all the cables that I've cut off, which I have to go upstairs now and get rid of. And then we've got this very strange thing. I have no idea what that is. And from the top you can see where all the cables come up. You've got the choke sitting there in the middle. Uh, to the left of that you've got the stop start switch for the electrics. And to the right, well you can't really see it but it's this. This is the emergency stop. This is the very nice uh, panel of switches and uh, we have some other random cables around here as well, all of which need to be sorted out. We have the engine on off and the strange cable was for that, so that can go because the engine isn't manual. Um, what else? Well, we've got this. This is the this is the starter cable. And I don't know if you can see, but there's about four threads left on that. It's not going very far at all. So I'm going to replace that. I'm going to take off this cable. I've managed to strip everything else out. And, um, well, we'll see what happens. And look at that for a first pile of rubbish. Incredible just how much rubbish you can take out of a boat. <laughs> 